Are you having network device issues? Is your network traffic at a standstill? PoE camera is not connecting? And your ring camera is not connecting either? Is your wireless signal weak? Or your phone can't obtain an IP address? Sounds like your network is broken. These are my best tips to fix your broken network and get it running smooth as butter. What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Mike, this is the Ultimate Tech Hub. Thank you for joining me, I really appreciate it. You guys are awesome. Over the last seven or eight years, I've seen every type of home networking issue imaginable. And I've been lucky enough to have two different network panels in my last two homes. One small panel and one large panel. And the bigger the network panel, the bigger the network issues. <laughs> so let's first start with a simple Wi-Fi fix. If your Wi-Fi is not working or cannot obtain an IP address, simply go into Wi-Fi settings and turn off the 2.4 and 5 gigahertz frequency channels. Hit apply, then go back in and turn them on. And this usually fixes the issue without having to reset your router. Also, if this is a brand new router, make sure that DHCP is enabled as well as NAT. Because if DHCP and NAT is not enabled, your network will not get a pool of IP addresses. And next is your ring camera is not connecting and has no video. How do you fix that? If your ring camera has a network cable connected to a PoE injector, unplug that cable, unplug the power to the PoE injector, and leave it off for about 30 seconds then plug everything back in. After that, the ring camera should connect and you should have video. And this technique works with all PoE cameras and NVR systems. And with the NVR system, I would unplug the power for 15 to 30 seconds then plug it back in. All right, do you have a switch and none of the ports are working? With no internet connection, you wanna unplug the power from the switch for about 15 seconds then plug it back in. Give it a couple minutes and everything should be up and running. But what if your entire network is down? Total disaster, nothing's working. This is how you fix a total network failure. First, unplug your modem. And when I say unplug your modem, all cables from the modem. Next, unplug the power to your router. Next, unplug the power to all your switches, every switch in the house. Now leave it alone for about 60 seconds, then go in this order. Plug your modem back in, all cables, power on your router, then plug power back in to all your switches. Now give this three or four minutes for all your devices to connect and everything should be back up and running. And this also works as a fix with a network that has unusually slow speeds. And remember, this is a full network reset and it will take time for all your devices to connect. And this includes IoT devices, thermostats, lights, appliances. And speaking of IoT devices, if your IoT devices and smart devices are struggling to stay connected to your network, then it's time to move that router to a more central location. Or you can always add another router. And don't be afraid to add more routers or access points to your home because more Wi-Fi is more better. Well, if you made it this far, guys, your network is back up and running smooth as butter. And hopefully one of these fixes works for your broken network. And one more thing, I encourage you to watch my ultimate home networking playlist. We have over 80 videos to help you with home networking. And as usual, guys, if you found this video helpful and you liked it, give a thumbs up and share it. And of course, hit subscribe, it's free. And I'll see you in the next video real soon. Peace.